Hello everyone and welcome to a new video showcase of another update. Today we have the huge and long-awaited update for Macaws Furniture, the update 3.0.0 and this update has a lot of changes, lots of improvements and <laughs> actually a ton of bug fixes. So, well, let's get started, am I right? Okay. So, well, oh yeah, right, before we start I have a huge disclaimer for you and that's all IDs have been changed. Why? Well, because if you remember the IDs were like mm, furniture 1, furniture 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and wardrobe 1, 2, 3, 5, 4, 6, so basically you could not find well, you could not manipulate with stuff if you were making something with the furniture and this way you can see that the double drawer has now the ID oak underscore double underscore drawer and the same here oak underscore drawer. So now, yeah, this means that this version is not backwards compatible with the older versions, sadly, and not just because of this change, but because of the placing too and we will talk about that later on in this video so well let's get started for new video uh, for the new stuff but yeah before we go there that way where all the new things are please make a backup of your world and uh, the most important thing is that everything you have stored in the furniture please put it in the chest and after you update you can put them back in them you know because yeah everything changed so just to be sure uh, I hope you will understand this thing but it had to be done I'm sorry okay let's get started so yeah well you can see that there's quite a lot of these du double yeah double wardrobes yeah these are the classic ones and here we have the new stripped variations. Yeah, that's great, right? Uh, maybe you have noticed that the model has been changed a little bit, so there is not a gap between them. So you can easily put them next to each other and you don't have the gap between them, which was kind of bad, at least what I've heard from you. Yeah, okay. So, what does this mean? Yeah, this means that the crafting recipes have been completely changed to make them a lot simpler and just easier to craft them. For example, this warped uh, double wardrobe you can craft like this. As you can see, you put warp stem in here and two cabinets, and I think you get about four of them when you craft it like that. Well, I mean, we can try it, am I right? So yeah, let's go here, take a crafting table and yeah, see you get four of them. And if you see here the cover desk and you can see the shapes are easily made so that you can figure out what is for what and it makes a lot more sense than before in the two points. I don't know which version it was, the last one. And yeah, how do you make the stripped ones? Well, actually, the only thing you have to change is you don't use the stem or locks but you have to use these stripped ones and that's all you will get this one and yeah you can store stuff in it yay okay well that's the first huge thing and we are already huh, three minutes in the video okay this will be a long video okay next up yeah this will be huge so these are all of the wardrobes and here we have a bookshelf and here we have drawers so what does... well, they have now two categories and why? Because... Here, let's take Oak Wardrobe, the classic one, and if you place one on top of it, it will combine and merge into a taller one. Well, maybe you like even taller ones like this. So you can go to Narnia or I don't know, <laughs> anything. The only bad thing is, but I mean, it's not that huge of an issue and 
maybe it will be solved someday is that the inventories do not merge so if you put something here and here you have to click on the different parts of it but this is really a small thing but i just don't had any idea how to get it working because you know if someone will make an eight block tall furniture and merge it it will just create some chaos and yeah another thing is if you aim on the right side of the block the handle will be on the right side see if you aim on the left side it will be on the left side well if you put one on the left and one on the right it will create this one and yeah so yeah basically this way you can create these huge wardrobes and you can see it works on this one as well this one as well here we have a bookshelf and here we have the new yeah this one you decide where you want to have this uh, cup Port, or basically this opening part where do you want it to have to be oh my god well, I'm so terrible in English today I'm sorry okay if you place it down like this it will be on the left side and if you aim on the right side of the block it will be on the right side this way you can create something like this yeah which is absolutely crazy just be care that if you place it here on the right and if you place it here on the left it will make something like this but this is not a bug it's just something you have to take care of yeah but look you can see that the gap is not here and this way you can really combine the furniture and make very creative stuff yeah i i like it very much and actually you can store stuff in this bookshelf as well so yay next up the drawers yeah they cannot be stacked like this but instead they go in the wide in the width of it basically if you put one next to it it will create a wider one a double one and if you place one here it will create a triple one and four five six eight, as much as you want uh, if you are holding the item you are placing you cannot open the inventory of it you can see yeah it will put it on top of it or yeah this is because well so you have it easier to build taller and wider furniture so it will not open so you don't have to yeah i have to shift and right click so it will now you can just stand and click and if you want to store anything just take another item not that one and you can open it i think this is a very good change at least at least that's what i think okay so if you place one here yeah you see all of them will merge you can even combine them like this if you want to like this see uh, yeah you can make so many custom stuff now let's see let's take this one you have to shift click when it's not that, that thing but that that's okay and see you have a completely custom furniture you can store something here something here something in here and so on yeah you can and you can see that this one is a new model, this one too, and this is a completely new furniture. Some of the old ones have been removed, but they could be added back if you really want to. I don't, I didn't knew that which ones you like the most, so I just guessed these ones were the best ones designed. So let me know in the comments below, please. Thank you. Okay, next up we have three desks. These desks can be made wider not like this that does not work at least yet but you can make them as wide as you want you can combine them with this one you can take for example this bookshelf and combine them or you can put a cupboard here like this and you have a desk for your computer or anything you want here we have a covered desk and you can see the id is oak covered desk so no more searching for weird ids and here we have the modern desk which has these nice stripped variations here the x one the, the i don't know how to call it yeah i'm sorry if oh i hope you didn't heard that i just hit the microphone a bit but i hope you will enjoy this update even if it is not backwards compatible but these changes are just so huge the biggest ones that even the <laughs> oh my god i'm so bad i'm sorry these changes are so huge, not just the ID, but even the multiple furniture which has been removed. If you remember, in the old versions you had a furniture that you placed down and it had like three of them or two of them. And this way you can just combine them and make anything you want, which is good. Absolutely, 
you have to let me know in the comments everything you want and anything anything any suggestions i will take anything i love to read your suggestions and comments because that is the thing which keeps these mods going going forwards yeah okay let's move to the tables we have a oak table which can be actually moved in any direction so you can create yeah this is a small bug but I don't think anyone will make a furniture like that. If yes, I will fix it in the next update. Maybe even in this release. This is just the calling, I think. Or just the model. But see, you can make a huge table. You can make a table like this, like this, or just like a tiny one like this. Here we have a end table, which has a plate here added. It's basically the same as that. And you can see that again you can combine them you can remove the center one and you can have a modern desk and just sit next to it with a chair yeah i mean that's good here we have a coffee table which is a really simple one yeah and lastly we have the most complex one a glass table and here yeah this one you can just have it in these shapes like a square one or a uh, what's this? I, I don't know the for word for it now. I'm too excited for this update. But yeah. Well, I guess no one will create create mm, desks or tables, I'm sorry, like this. But if yeah, I will add another model for it. But I guess a lot of people, well, if not everyone will make them like this. Yeah. Okay. So I guess we can move on. Oh yeah, here are the counters. They have a new model. You can see that on top now we have a stripped variation of the lock. Not the same one as here, the bark one. This is the classic one, yeah. And here we have the stripped variation, which is reverse, not reverted, which is the opposite of this one. So basically on top we have the bark texture and down here we have the stripped variation yeah and same about the drawers and cabinets yeah you can see yeah and except for these three ones these ones have inventory so you can store your stuff in them they cannot combine because i thought that there are not many counters which can be combined so they would merge so i just make them like this so you can style and design your kitchen or anything just like you want but yeah let me know you, you have to let me know everything about this update because yeah i don't want to make unnecessary changes for them okay now yeah great stuff if you place something in the inventory it now emits a comparator signal and yeah hoppers work and actually even if you know the mod create the chutes work as well so not mo no more bugs in them with them yeah yeah another small addition is that if you hate the furniture and you you like yeah i have four desks i will never use you can just burn them and use it as a fuel so yeah <laughs> even that's something you can do <laughs> Oh, this is one of my favorite changes. Yeah, as you can see, any, furni any furniture which has a book in it, in the recipe, it will emit enchanting power just like a classic bookshelf for the enchantment table. So if we take another right pickaxe and place it down, we can see that we have a 24 level. Yeah, because there's a lot of them, which is great. I, 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 I think I know that you will love this feature as much as I do and before we move actually to the last one I just wanted to show you that yeah this is everything we have which is crazy <laughs> it's really crazy yeah here we have the chairs the stool yeah and a lot of it can be added it, it depends on you just let me know in the comments below <laughs> oh yeah and all reported bugs and issues have been resolved anything for example there was a bug with if you held on 
for example, yeah, this stem and open the inventory, it would place it here. Another issue was that when you held a snowball and opened it, it would just shoot it out, but no, that's fixed too. And just oh, so many issues have been fixed. A lot of crashes, incompatibility, <laughs> incompa yeah, anything, vein mining duplicates, multi-block furniture, everything is out, everything is fixed, crashes are fixed. Tile entity not correctly removing itself is fixed. A lot of duplication glitches are fixed now. Yeah. And well, a lot more. Just check out the changelog. And again, I want to just say that please take care before you install this update and create a backup or save everything from your old furniture in chests for the while when you, for the moment when you upgrade it from this one because all the old furniture will be removed since it had the old IDs, it had drawer 1, drawer 2 and so on and these ones are just made correctly and organized so it is all good, okay. And yeah, that's all for this video, I hope it's not too long. And um, yeah, you have to let me know in the comments, you should join our Discord channel where I post polls, suggestions, idea showcases and we just discuss stuff about everything if you have any issue you can go to github uh, put the bug in in there and yeah if you enjoy these videos these showcases you can subscribe to my channel and be notified for future videos and showcases like this i can say now that if you are still watching peachy is working on a new mod which will be announced very soon it's almost complete it is a simpler mod but it is you will love it there is, no I, I won't say anything about it but yeah so stay tuned now i will work on some fabric ports like for windows doors bridges roofs and so on furniture will be the last mod ported for fabric as it will be the hardest one to port but yeah i'm looking forward to it and thank you so much for watching this video have a nice day enjoy this update and yeah, goodbye.